Well, welcome back. This is Tim Nash from the Shropshire Star, bringing you the latest on Shrewsbury Town. And uh, in today's editions, we've got uh, Mark Halstead, uh, goalkeeper Mark Halstead, um, saying that uh, uh, the third round tie is there for the taking for uh, Shrewsbury Town if they perform as they did in the second half um, on Saturday at Peterborough when they uh, gained a valuable point in a, uh, a one-all uh, one draw. Hard-earned point it was too with uh, with substitute by uh, Tyrone Barnett scoring the uh, equaliser uh, on his first return to his old club. We've also got uh, Mickey Mellon relishing the uh, the uh, the tie. Um, also, you know, saying that uh, he's looking forward to uh, an FA Cup tie under lights at the Meadow uh, as they uh, um, if they win, of course, they get uh, the carrot of a, an away uh, trip to uh, Championship side Cardiff in the third round. Um, so he's looking forward to that as well. We've also got uh, Nat Knight Percival. Uh, wary of the um, the threat of Grimsby Town after the uh, the uh, nil nil draw at Blundell Park, of course, in the first game, um, uh, Knight Percival speaks from experience as he's uh, uh, caused uh, been part of two sides that have caused sh shocks in the past uh, at non-league level. Uh, he played for Histon uh, and Wrexham. Histon, of course, uh, famously beat uh, Leeds. Um, a few years ago, Knight Percival was was part of that uh, side, and uh, he was also part of the team uh, that uh, uh, drew uh, away at um, Championship side Brighton uh, before uh, holding them again in a replay, but then going out on penalties. So uh, plenty of experience at uh, of, uh, of upsets in the uh, Shrewsbury Town camp.